One, two, one, two. Let's one, do a little two, more one, testing. Two. One, two, three, four. But four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> counting with Caitlin. I didn't go to school for counting. <laughs> didn't go to school at all. I'm Greta Thunberg. You found me in the woods. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I'm Caitlin Powell. And I'm Kate Butch. And this is Queers Gone By, the show we talk about nostalgic film, TV, and snacks, and try to work out if that's what made us queer. And today... Happy birthday! (laughs) (laughs) Dario! It's my birthday. Oh my god, what? How old are you turning? 17. Oh my god, say, (laughs) I'm turning 17 next week. (laughs) Well, I have to say 17, because... I am already older than you, and you insist you're 17. So you are 17. I am 17. Ever. Number 17, the spread eagle. No. I was in such a state of shock, I completely blacked out, I can't remember a thing. It wasn't until later when I was washing the blood off my hands that I even knew they were dead. Oh, I keep whacking things. Stop it. Sorry. It's your special day. My special day. Getting violent. Let and me get whacking. <laughs> Whack your things along with us. Whack your things along with if, us. If you've not do. been whacking along. What have we been doing this for? <laughs> Um, is it, it's, it's your birthday, so this is Thursday, yep. and your birthday's on Sunday, Sunday. oh, three Yay. days till your birthday, what are you hoping for? Um, oh, just a little nap, <laughs> to be quite honest. Yeah, have a little nap. Yeah. World peace. Eh. eh. If it came at the expense of a nap, no. <laughs> <laughs> never not napping. Never not napping. No, I'm never napping, that's never, the problem. That's the prob- I don't like a nap. I hate a nap, but sometimes you need one. I, I think what I want for my birthday is to be the kind of person who can have a nap. I, I can't get you that. Okay, well, this is nice. <laughs> <laughs> I have actually got you a very nice present. Have you? Yes, I will forewarn you that I did step on the box. So it's oh. slightly... It's, the contents are fine. The box is just in a little sad state of okay. being stepped on. I've got you two small things, mm-hmm. one of which is really cute and one is disgusting. And I think you know what it is. I don't, but that sounds oh, very okay, exciting. Okay. <laughs> That honestly is the two halves of my personality. Yeah, exactly. Cute and disgusting. <laughs> Thank you. The Kate Butch experience. And also for your birthday. Oh yeah. You are choosing <gasps> yes. a very special. Extremely special. Piece of media. Mm-hmm. What are we doing? The one that started it all. They're all the ones that started it all, but this especially. It started my love of a certain lionfish. <laughs> <laughs> and my obsession with sea creatures. Was she born with it? Is it autism? Probably both. <laughs> You are born with autism, aren't you? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Probably both. Probably both. <laughs> what is it? It's Shark Tale. Shark Tale. <laughs> da, da. Da, da. But not that one. It's not Jaws. No. Working at the car wash. <laughs> that Christina Aguilera jellyfish. <laughs> She's on it for long, but by God, does she make her mark? Yeah. <laughs> Chewing up that scenery. Yeah. Um, 2004. Yeah. What an era. What, what an era. Same year as Shrek 2. And I think they were swapping notes. Yeah. I don't think Shark Tale got the memo, but Shrek 2 sent it by pigeon. <laughs> it got lost. It got wet. Yeah, it got a bit <laughs> wet. Um, this is very DreamWorks. Extremely so, S- yeah. Somewhat upsettingly so. Yeah. It's also very much like... Oh, you were doing Finding Nemo, were you, Pixar? Well, Guess look what, what we've got for you. It's awful. <laughs> this was nominated for the best animated film at I the Oscars. See it. Who won? Because there weren't that many Shrek Oscars. Too. I, mm, the Incredibles. The Incredibles was the same year? Yeah. We were spoilt for choice. We were. We didn't know how good we had it. We didn't, and now it's gone. No, that was, that was too many. Elemental? I keep seeing adverts for that. Apparently Elemental is like <clears throat> the second, or the, the best, highest grossing Disney film since Frozen 2. What was it before Frozen 2? Probably Frozen 1. Okay. I know not a single person who has seen Elemental. No. Is it, if you've seen it, let us, don't. Actually, I I do know one person, and she's 12, so <laughs> maybe that's why. they got all the money, them 12-year-olds. <laughs> Money, are. access. <laughs> <laughs> and other things. And other things. And a third thing. Um, <laughs> Rule of three. Is it, is it like Zootopia? I don't know. I think it's just fire it, it's, and clouds and there's a fight. I think it's about racism. Oh. I watched a very good TikTok about how Zootopia is racist. Well. So I recommend that. A cab. 
Yeah, I've never actually seen Zootopia. The rabbit's a police officer. You know I watched the whole 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> you probably learnt more about it. Than it's, exactly. Yes, because like, they're like rabid animals. Yeah, and, and it's coded in a very like ra- racist way, right? Yeah. yeah, okay, yeah. They tried. They did not succeed. Okay. But you know who did succeed? Shark Tank. Shark Tank. <laughs> <laughs> Unproblematic fave. Question mark. I don't want to stand by that. <laughs> we'll get into yeah. it. <laughs> Yeah, I'm having such a sea creatures renaissance right now. <laughs> Are you? Uh, I really like... Explain further, please. <laughs> no, I love sea creatures. They're so... Oh, no, I'm hitting things. It's not even my birthday yet. It's not your birthday. You're not allowed to hit things. Sorry. <laughs> I just love sea creatures. I think they're so interesting. What's your favourite sea creature? Oh, um, a blue dragon sea slug. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm getting one tattooed. I just got You're it obsessed confirmed. with a blue dragon. I love a blue dragon Why don't you slug. marry it then? If I could... You, you skin marrying it. My, if my girlfriend asked tattoo. me, would you still love me if I was a blue Will dragon sea slug? Will you still love me when I'm a blue dragon sea slug? And yes, beautiful. <laughs> you don't have to be beautiful, babe. <laughs> <laughs> I'll marry a sea slug. What do they do? What's their story? They're so, oh my God. They're so cool. Um, <laughs> so blue dragon sea slugs feed on the um, toxins of, uh, I think it's man of war jellyfish. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, so they're blue and the blue is all the toxins and my favourite thing about them and the reason I'm getting them tattooed is because uh, a guy on TikTok was doing a TikTok where he picked up these jellyfish no sea slugs and everyone commented like oh my god put it down you're basically fondling a man of war jellyfish and he was like no I'm a fucking guy I'm gonna hold the jellyfish it can't no, I'm a fucking man. I'm, a, I'm gonna hold the sea slug. They can't hurt me. And then his next TikTok was, "Guys, I'm in hospital." <laughs> I love them so much. <laughs> Lovely. They're great. They take in the toxins and then poof, put it all out into the world. And that's yeah. Uh, Don't. Uh, yeah, I see it. <laughs> <laughs> I love them so much. <laughs> yeah, I don't love the sea. Never Don't. underestimate the sea. Mother sea, great mother sea. Yeah, I respect her from a distance. Okay. All right. I don't know what's in there. What's in you? Sea slugs. Just yeah, <laughs> just full of sea slugs. Yeah. There's just so much of it, and it's so deep. There is quite a lot of it. Full of billionaires. I'm spicy today. Are you going to text me in 24 hours time and say, "Please, can you take out a bit about billionaires"? <laughs> no. Last time I had to text you that because we got something wrong. <laughs> we did. Yeah. And and then. But we don't need to talk about it because no, I took don't. it out. <laughs> Do you know uh, a good shark fact? What? Oh, it's a very sad shark fact, actually. I Hit can't, me. I can't remember what it's called, but they have um, a, a, a condition in their brains, which means they have a compulsive desire to kiss, but because they've got no Slots. lips, they can't get kissing. Oh. So that's why they're so sad. <laughs> oh. Oh. If you're a marine biologist, and I've got that a bit wrong. I can't imagine Keep a it shark yourself, it's my birthday. <laughs> I can't, yeah. yeah, I can't imagine a shark kissing. I think you might be right. That's the tragedy of it all. Yeah. <laughs> Incel sharks. I guess, yeah. I love sharks. Yeah, and yet you won't li- let a Labrador lick your face. I'd let a shark lick my face. Would you let a shark kiss you? Um, would you French a shark? I wouldn't kiss it. I'd love to touch one. I'd like to. Would you go in a cage? It, I don't know. I think if other people were going before me and I saw it was safe, yes. Okay. Would you do it? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. You have no fear of death, though. No, I don't. <laughs> That's Which I think is very mentally healthy. Mm. <laughs> and I will... T- no, no further questions. Okay, sure. <laughs> I've swum with dolphins. I have too. Why did you swim with dolphins? <laughs> I've told you this story. <laughs> I think you have. Do you want to tell the rest of the people? <laughs> I just remembered the story. <laughs> so, I was... um. Uh, I was on holiday with my family and we were told we were going to swim with dolphins and so we went out on this it's fairly like rickety boat and the waves were very rush rough no the waves were very hard choppy waters choppy choppy waters um and me and my mother were not convinced that this was the time nor place to be swimming with dolphins but they were right by the boat and so everyone was like come on get in I was a fairly rotund child <laughs> as we have discussed yes and so i have the distinct memory of my mother standing at the top of the steps going i don't want to get in and a man picking my i don't know how old like eight year old body up 
and just rugby throwing it into the sea. <laughs> And they're fat phobic. So, <laughs> so I start feeling these dolphins like fucking, I don't know, maybe, maybe the trauma has got to me. But I <laughs> feel dolphins all around me. They're not like, I don't know, I'm not clinging onto it. And they're not swimming to safety like they would in the films. They're bopping me in all sorts. <laughs> they're uh, bopping you in all sorts. So someone had to jump. Someone had to jump in and save me. We're good again, yeah. <laughs> And, and bop, bop you on the head. <laughs> so yeah, that's my memory of swimming with dolphins. I had a lovely time swimming with dolphins. Good for you. Um, they were in a little, little holding pen. Oh. No, no, we were waiting to oh, go I with see, the dolphins. I, see, I, see. I mean, the dolphins probably weren't in that open water. What do you mean, probably? We were in, like, Florida. Oh, okay. So the enough. dolphins probably also homophobic. No, lots of gay dolphins. Florida, though. Oh, Mm. So the gay dolphins have it a lot worse. Lots of bigots live in, mm. live in Florida. Bigot dolphin. Bigot dolphin. Yeah. Um, but there we'll we... get to gay dolphins in a second we because will. of this film. <laughs> well, probably about an hour and a half. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> um, I looked down and there was like a whole like cavern, like it was kind of like Little mermaid Yeah. And there were definitely sharks in the bottom. What? Like, there are some was, friendly sharks. Was the floor going to drop? What? How so are you it was like a really it? deep, like kind of like a well. Uh-huh. And there were loads of fish just like swimming around in a circle yeah. having a nice time. And there were definitely sharks at the bottom. What sort of sharks? Little ones. Like little, little friendly ones. Like dog fish? Or like a... I don't know. Blue shark? I didn't ask them. We have... Sh- I, I follow a guy on TikTok who does like snorkeling off like the coast of Brighton. Coast of Brighton? Off Brighton Pier and stuff. And there are, do- there are sharks there? Dog fish, yeah. Which is a type of shark. You hear that, Crudy Dench? <coughs> Your days are numbered. <laughs> The dog She's the biggest here. dog amongst them. <laughs> oh, fuck it up. <laughs> Should we talk about this film? Yes, we get the DreamWorks logo. When talk- the writers came up with this, I think they had a day off. <laughs> what? They get the, the, the boy with his fishing. Yeah. And we pan down and he's fishing with a worm. Yeah. A horrid little worm. Oh, we get a nasty little POV. No, it's not a POV. TikTok has ruined the definition of POV. Yes. <laughs> um, porn had it sorted. <laughs> and TikTok just... <laughs> Um, yeah, horrible little worm flying through the air I on the end of a it. hook. Yeah, nasty. Because I think, actually, the, the boy doing the fishing out of the moon is quite chic. Yes, this was unchic. They besmirched his <clears> good name. <laughs> yes, they did. Also, the cat Does he have did a name? Well. Malcolm. Malcolm. I don't know. <laughs> it's DreamWorks Malcolm. DreamWorks Malcolm. Miriam, can you Google Malcolm for us? Miriam, get DreamWorks Malcolm on the phone. <laughs> She won't do it. She's fallen out with them. Yeah. Since well, washed away. Since his good name was besmirched by this. Oh, I see, yes. Yeah. <laughs> um, <clears throat> we get we get the Jaws music. Yeah. Oh, they spent some money. They did to get... Two notes. Yep. <laughs> and we see Jack Black. As like the cast in this film. Jack Black is the only one amongst this lead cast who doesn't have an Oscar. <laughs> That's an incredible fact. And I think he should yeah, get on why the, not? the holiday. School of Rock. School of Rock. Yeah. And other things that he's at. Gulliver's Travels. Did you ever see that? I did. Garbage. Yeah. Horrid little film. Awful. Um, but yeah, he's Lenny, the shark, and yeah. he's a vegetarian. Yes. And um, he frees the worm. <clears throat> yes. And he picks flowers. Yes. And his brother Frankie is dead mask and slaps yeah. him. Stim in the Jaws theme tune. <laughs> <laughs> he just can't stop singing it. He just can't. He loves it. Yeah. Um, but he's like, no, don't be like freeing worms. Eat some worms. Stop picking flowers, you little faggot. He doesn't say it, but he says it with his eyes. He says it with his eyes, his little yeah. sharky eyes, his little very quite poorly animated shark. <laughs> Listen, I'm not an yeah. animator, but <clears throat> this is 2004. That's about 10 years after Toy Story. Whoa, really? It looks worse than Toy Story. It does. It was in that era when I think they were trying to make it look more modern. And it does look more modern, but also worse. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And they, like, they love a modern reference, don't they? Oh, they bloody do. This this bit shat me up. Which bit? We meet Katie Current. I have a lot to say about this. So Katie Current is a news reporter. <clears throat> She's an obvious parody of Katie Couric, the yes. American news lady. And she is played by a female sea bass. Is she? It's a sea bass, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm having a sea creature's renaissance. I see, okay. <laughs> <laughs> she... <laughs> Everybody... <laughs> 
what Beyonce's singing about. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, um, yes, yeah, so this is Seabass, is modelled after Katie Couric. Who, in the American release, is voiced by Katie Couric. Yes. However... We British weren't ready for Katie Couric. We couldn't, but we couldn't even have Finona Phillips. <laughs> Who's Phillips? She's voiced by Fiona Phillips. Oh, is she? Yes. They got a oh, different... Oh, from GMTV? Yeah. They got yeah. a different newsreader to play That's her. That's not even... She's not even that famous. No. In the Finona Aust- Bruce? Well, yes, quite. I, I was also thinking that. The Australian one had um, Tracy Grimshaw. Grimshaw... These things just write themselves. They're not good, <laughs> but they write themselves. <sighs> um, but yeah, I don't like because we got the Katie Couric reference. Yeah. So why, why? don't they just? It was like in Shrek Two when they had a fashion police moment and they replaced Joan Rivers in the American one yeah. with Kate. Somewhat Kate uh, from from the X Factor. I thought it was Kim, um, Kelly Osbourne. Did they not do Kelly Osbourne? No. She oh. was in Muppets Wizard of Oz. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking of. Specifically in your Muppets Wizard of Oz and not in mine. That was a strange time, wasn't oh, that it? That was weird. Um, Go back and listen to that episode if uh, you want to have a, I don't know, breakdown. It was Kate someone who does the X Factor, who did the X Factor, the original X Factor host. They replaced okay. Joan Rivers being like, who are you wearing? Oh. And it made no sense. And like, we would have... No, no one's like, oh my god, yes, Kate from the X Factor. But I think crucially, did they have a different animated person? I don't think so. So it was just someone else voicing Joan Rivers. Yeah, and they did—they didn't change Katie Katie Curran. That pissed me off. But yeah. speaking of fish puns, we yeah. get a whole montage of like life in the city, the fish city. Ah. Oh. And we get we get, look at the, the I walk have a of fame. One. Do you? So we've got oh, not in the walk of fame. Yeah, you you muscle crow. Yes. Um, Jessica Shrimpson. Cod Stewart. Cod Stewart and <laughs> Seal. Yeah. But it's a sea lion that we're seeing. We're showing a sea lion. Are we? Because he goes, ar, ar, and he claps oh. his hands together. Also, what's he doing that deep? This place isn't for, this isn't for you, deep. sir. But I, I don't think he'd be in a... Oh, maybe he would be in a reef. We're not really given any idea where this is. At in least, the world. at least in Finding Nemo, we know it's P. Sherman forced you Wallaby Way, Sydney. Exactly, we're not given an address. Um. <laughs> <laughs> just the general that reef. Is, <laughs> this is just the one plot hole this film has. <laughs> <laughs> the rest of it, perfect. Yes, um, I enjoy. Like, oh, carry oh, on. We've got the taxi fish. Yes. Um, clams that sell their pearls. Yeah. What do you enjoy? Prawn shop. Oh, is that <laughs> what it is? Oh, I did. Because pawn this shop. Yeah, I get that. Yeah, yeah. And it's a beautiful little blue prawn. And um, we go to an empty sushi restaurant. <laughs> this made me laugh out loud. <laughs> that was really funny. Yeah. It's like a sushi chef who's like an octopus or whatever. Monsters yeah. encoded. Um, and he's like, oh, oh yeah, he still wants to eat themselves. Yeah. <laughs> Very funny. Um, and then keep his wife's name out your fucking mouth. It's Will Smith Fish. Yes. Will Fish. Will Fish. He plays Oscar. Yes. They were, they were vying for that statuette. Oh, they were. <laughs> he has an Oscar, right? Now he does. Now he does. From the slapping. From that very eve. That very eve. Did he win it before or after the slapping? I can't remember. Uh, surely, surely before. I don't know. Oh, no. we'll interesting. Find out. Um, he's um he's in his crib in his penthouse. Did a little dance. Um, so I had the Shark Tale PC game. Of course you fucking did. I was. Was it from TK Maxx? Um, no. No. I don't know where it was. That's from. where I got all my CD ROMs. What? What was like? Was it game? Yes. I was about to say, what was the game shop? Game. It was game. <laughs> I think it was from game. Oh, I loved going in a game. Yeah. Oh, them little virgins. I remember Them greasy haired got... virgins being like, do you want to buy Hello. a DS game? <laughs> <laughs> about, yeah, I do actually Nintendogs. Nintendo. I begged, borrowed, pleaded for a Nintendogs game. I ruined many a family gathering. <laughs> yeah. Like, shouting into the microphone. Like, <laughs> Sit. <laughs> Sit. <laughs> Sit. And it also had the Shrek 2 DS game, which was fucking Ooh, great. And I Shrek had, Ogres and Dronkies. I had the Shrek 2 PC game. Uh, but in the Shark Tale game, so we see him uh, in his little pen... Well, it's, he's, he's posing in front of a billboard, but it looks like he's in a penthouse. And later on, he gets a penthouse. In the game, you could buy the penthouse and you could decorate it. And it was my favourite bit. Oh, you love a decoration, I don't you? I love a you? decoration, yeah. Animal Crossing, your island is the talk of the town. <sighs> that specific cat town. That's the island. Town. Yeah. yeah, just the, the talk of the island. Yeah. <laughs> the Camomile. only people talk about that. Is it called Camomile? 
that is the best. Camom Isle. Camom Isle. Camom Isle. Yes. <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs> Don't ruin this, please. Ta-ra, I'm begging you. <laughs> I'm begging you not to ruin this. <laughs> Ta-ra. <laughs> On your birthday, no On less. my birthday. Um, um, I was like, why have they got, how have they got TVs in PlayStations under the sea? Under the sea. I have, okay, if we're going to talk about problems with this, <laughs> we see um, a load of kids graffitiing. We have to assume with oil-based paint. <laughs> we have to assume. We simply do. Yeah, how does it, how does a spray aerosol? Yeah work underwater it simply Not doesn't well, bitch. so we have to assume <laughs> well they've got little brushes out yeah painted dead quick mm-hmm. how are these fish not electrocuted <laughs> is also my yeah well there's, a- there's actual torture later well yes but like if yeah. they're plugging in a telly yeah and they've got big tv sc- times square screens yeah have a word dreamworks have a word dreamworks um he's got no money he doesn't live he's in the got penthouse. no money he doesn't live in the penthouse but so he's off to work where does he work? <sighs> the car wash. This film was a gateway drug to me finding out who Christina Aguilera and Missy Elliott were. That's fair. I didn't know. And I think that's fair because we were eight when this came out. Yeah. Yeah. I don't. Yeah. I... Dirty had come out two years before, but I think six is a bit young to know what dirty is. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. Get your girls, get your boys, gonna make some noise. Bisexual yeah. anthem. Exactly. Um, I didn't really know who Christina Aguilera was. I, could, I I still don't think I could pick her out of a lineup. What? And I've seen burlesque. Get your ass up, show me how you burlesque. They really tried to go... I was mainly looking at Cher. Yeah, fair. Yeah. On Drag Race, they really t- tried to go, she looks identical to Farrah Moon. And sh- she's blonde, sure, but I don't... She's certainly got wavy hair. Yeah. Oh, Reflection, though. Mm-hmm. From Mulan. Did she sing that? Yeah. Wow! <laughs> that girl oh. Holler back girl? No, it's Gwen Stefani. Ooh. 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 Yeah, see, I, Gwen Stefani and... I get them a bit confused. Yeah, yeah Christina's the one who sings well. real big. And Gwen Stefani's like this. And she was in, like, a more rock-ish band. Dance big. Is that Christina? Pretty sure. Hang on. Is it? No, no, that's I'm Gwen. a genie in a bottle. That's Gwen. But Gwen had, before her solo career, was in a band. Oh. Oh. And similar to I'm Just a Girl. I'm pretty sure that's in the band, not solo. I don't follow her career closely. I'm sorry. Mm. I, d- I did find out on Wikipedia yeah. that um, uh, I believe Beyonce mm-hmm. was meant to do a duet was with Janet a Jackson. <laughs> 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 yeah. She was meant to do a duet with Janet Jackson for this. For this? For this. What? Mm. Was that going to be Car Wash? I don't know, but maybe just for some other, like the, when you believe of the film. Wow. That's amazing. Could have been even better than it already is. (laughs) How? (laughs) (laughs) I did not know she was in this. She loves a DreamWorks film. Renee Zellweger. Yeah. She has high pony energy in this. Pony? High ponytail. Oh, I see. I pushed a, a high pony. A, no, a, seahorse. a mad horse. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, yeah, she's a bit. She's a bit uncanny bland. valley because they've made later on. They really pasted Martin Scorsese onto that puffer fish. <laughs> they they make a real effort to make them look like the fish look like the people. Yeah. It it goes a bit wrong with Angie. Yes. Sorry, Angie the fish. The fish played, played by Ray Doesn't make any sense. It doesn't. Just call me Angelina Jolie fish, Angie. Yeah. Anyway, anyway. Yeah. she's real uncanny valley, bubblegum, mm. pinky purple, Bridget Jones vibes. Well, um, she works in reception and she's in love with Oscar. Yeah, she doodles Angie and Oscar in a heart because it's 2004. Mrs. Still Fiona Charing. Mrs. Fiona Charing. Well, they've all got iPads now, haven't they? Oh. I think they pr- could probably do it on an iPad. But... Yeah, but do they? Who Write you, in. Who were you writing your name in a love heart with? Um, Angelina Jolie. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. And mine was Shrek. Gethin Jones. Geth- oh. <laughs> are you, wait, is that me or you? You. No, yeah. 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 I know. <laughs> Bits. Yeah. Do you ever watch Morning Live at 9.15 on a weekday, BBC One? No, I don't. Sometimes I do. Just well, you've got an Gethin's evening job, haven't you? <laughs> yeah. And his lovely friends, Dr. Zand. Huh? He's quite fit as well. They always have a strictly Doctors professional. What? what? Dr. Zand. Alexander X A N D. That's silly. He's a twin. That's even worse. <laughs> what um what's he do? 
I'm confused. I've lost. Kevin Jones. Track. He hosts a little, little. It's basically the one show, but in the morning. Okay. And th- then they have. Um, Dr. Range is also there sometimes. Oh, I like Dr. Dr. Range. Dr. Amos off the traitors. He's there. <gasps> Fates. I don't remember him at all. So he got he got kicked off at the, the start because he was very chivalrous. And then he came back in the church with a mask on. Okay. He's fit. Okay. I'll show you a picture of him. Right. Um, and then at the end, they have a strictly professional do a little dance. Oh, this sounds charming. It's very charming. Yeah. And yeah, just nothing Can happens for 45 you minutes. It's nice Cheerios. to just. Yeah. <laughs> have a little gorp. Just, it's such a gorping program. Gorp or gawk? It's gawk, isn't it? It's not gorp. I think both. Oh, sure. Gawk and a gorp. <laughs> gawky gorps along with us. <laughs> a gorpy gawky gawk <laughs> uh, My, I think my mum listens to this. This is what I imagine that she just hears. Swedish chef. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> Charlie Brown mum. Uh, <laughs> Fucking hell. Anyway, um, Oscar's got money-making scheme ideas. He bottled wants, water. Ha, 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 ha. And he's bought her a Kelpie cream donut. That's <laughs> ah, 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 ah. a modern reference. Chris yeah. Crims. Mm-hmm. Anyway, um, Martin Scorsese, Papa Fish, Sykes. And Don Lino, Robert played De- by Robert De Niro. He's having a great time in this. <laughs> he's having such he a is, good time. He is. He's feeding his piranhas. Yes. Um, Weird. Yeah. Bit like Mickey Mouse having a dog. Yeah. But I guess he it makes sense because he's the top of the food chain. That's true, yes. Um, Sykes is rude about Lenny being a bad shark. Yes. Being a little puff. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> so Don Lino's like, get out. You're good. I got you. And he throws him against the picture uh-huh. of sexy Kate Winslet from Titanic. Yes. Which is a little funny reference. Mm-hmm. There's a lot of Titanic references here. Yeah, it's a wicked world of bits again, <laughs> so, this film. And it's, it's even bigger because it's the sea. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. 70% of the world of bits. Yeah. There's a fun bit where he's like, my Lenny's a killer, a cold-blooded killer. Look at him. And Lenny's just like squeaking on a little bar stool, <laughs> spinning round and round, which is me coded. <laughs> a shark on a bar stool is funny. Yeah. It I'll is. give him that. Yeah. Um, um, there's a bit of an accident at work at the car wash. Oscar like, Oscar's moaning about how he works at a car wash, even though his whole thing is that he works at a car wash. Mm. The whale gets indigestion. Yeah, and does Oscar a little burp. Saves. There's this whole bit where we see him as a hero, but it's like undermined by the fact that it's just a little burp. Nothing horrible happens. Mm. Um, and the hench jellyfish. Oh Ernie yes. and Bernie. Yeah. One of whom is Ziggy Marley. Is that his name? Yeah. Yeah. All the stars are here. <laughs> All of the true beauties are here. Um, uh, they take him to Sykes. Um, Again, this this Martin Scorsese profile on an inflatable fish. I don't know how they did it. It's incredible. <laughs> His profile is Martin Scorsese. It is, yeah. It's incredible. Uncanny. Sykes. Sykes. Oh, my God. What? Not afraid to reference or not reference Oliver and Company. <laughs> my. Or indeed, Oliver Twist, the original book. No, Oliver and Company. <laughs> Which I did for my birthday two years ago. Yes. Oh my God. It's kind of an obnoxious shark bonanza. Yeah. There is an obnoxious redhead in this. The, oh. A sh- Boy, it going. how do you she obnoxious? <laughs> yes. Um, Sykes yeah. says to Oscar, you owe me 5,000. Yes. And I'm like, 5,000 what? And then they tell us. It's, Clams. We saw a clam Just get walking picked. and talking yeah. earlier. <laughs> do they trade in corpses? Yeah. I'm not sure we should unpack the monetary I would like to okay <laughs> yeah okay just hand a note it makes no sense no. do you like urchins or something they're alive too yeah, or do you need little got, children have... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that Oliver drowned twist children <laughs> yeah. here mister <laughs> bet me on the horses <laughs> <laughs> yes yeah Okay. okay, what else could that pearls? That's quite That's a lot. But well, how many urchins per pearl? Surely like a pearl's worth five thousand clams. Oh exactly. So how many how many pearls do you reckon for an urchin? <laughs> no, how many urchins for a pearl? How many urchins What's for a pearl? What's the conversion how many rate? Do you want? <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, yes. I, it's, I, it's a weird system. Yeah. And I they haven't thought this through. They, thought they didn't through. think. They've mugged you off, 20 darling. years later, <laughs> two gays have been picking it apart. Years. Yes. <laughs> Which is wild, because I but definitely saw this in right. the cinema. No, oh, it can't no, be right, because we're, we're 17. Because we're 17. <laughs> it's 19 years since, yeah. 
I genuinely just thought that can't be right because I'm 24. <laughs> no, no, no. We're 17. <laughs> We're 17. <laughs> we are. We are. We're dancing queens, young and sweet. <laughs> yes. Only 17. Well, I'm Tambourines. sitting in the booth, queen. <laughs> young and sweet. Having a sit down. Having a sit, queen. <laughs> <laughs> only 17. I'm the sweaty queen. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're hosting a bingo queen. I am number seventeen. Yeah, a spread that? eagle. Uh, oh, do you just do we dancing play dancing queen, queen and then okay. all the hen parties? Have you talked about your least favourite ones? Oh, where do I start? Oh, can you or is it is that going to get you fired? <laughs> Who gives a shit? Um, <laughs> they don't listen. They don't support me. Um, what what which ones do we do? Oh, so there's um, back streets back all right. Okay, I'll t- I'll tell you some good ones. Okay. That's in Queen number 17. Mm-hmm. Whoa, we're halfway there. Whoa, 11 on a prayer. That's good. I don't like that. Oh, fuck off then. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, 19. Hey, okay, yeah, I know that one. Uh, sweet Caroline. Oh, I like that. Yeah. That's fun. Club Tropicana drinks are three. Nice. Um, Summer of 69, of course. Lovely. Um, they don't do Taylor Swift's 22. They took that off there, even though their entire clientele is... 20 something year old white women, yeah, from Essex. Okay, why do, so do I they just have to with? go on that? They don't do anything, they just say the number 22. Two little dogs, fuck off. No, I literally have to stop the show and go, Right, everyone, I don't know about you, but I'm feeling 22. And then I go, Riddled with IBS. <laughs> 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 and the one person who's listening finds that hilarious. <laughs> um, the ones I don't like, yeah. Oh, Christina Aguilera, 30. That's a good oh, one. Oh, that's good, yeah. Get 30. Um, we do Toto's Africa, which I played the other day and a group of women cried. <laughs> what? I have no idea. What? It was bizarre. Do they, they have the, Toto the, trauma? I th- it was the vibe that like, it was like their dead dad's favourite song. <gasps> no. And so I was just like singing it and they stopped and looked over at them and they were just like wiping tears away. Oh my God. And I was, Maybe I'm your s- performance was so moving. Oh, of course. <laughs> It's because they weren't winning. They could have won 150 quid, but they went out with 10, and they were uh. the worst people I've ever met. Okay. Uh, <laughs> so fuck them, really. Fuck them, honestly. Yeah. Wait, so um, what's the number for Toto's Africa? Oh, so. Uh, I hear the drums are going tonight. It's got quite a slow. Yeah. She's coming in 1230 flight. Two numbers. It's neither of those. Gonna take a lot to drag me away from you. There's nothing that 100 men or more can ever do. We don't go as high as 100. It's not that one. Okay. I bless the rains down in Africa. Gonna take some nine to do the things we never had. So you've got three options there. And, and instead change the word time to nine. It's a half rhyme. Another one that I hate. Yeah. Um, Backstreet Boys. Backstreet's back all right. Yeah. Um, am I original? <laughs> am I the only one? It's not that number. Because oh my it God. is instead. Am I sexual? No. No, I'm not. But so you have to say six you all in public. And I have to go, am I the only person? Don't dab off number one, <laughs> please. <laughs> no one thought this through. Literally no one thought this through. Hmm. So the jellyfish torture Will Smith. Yeah, sorry, I just think about also the song, I want to run to you. What number do you think that is? Two. You would, wouldn't you? Yeah. It's not. I want a one to you. No, what? It's because. I don't even know what song that is. Caitlin, it's, I think it's Bruce Springsteen or something. Oh, okay. It's because straight men are in charge. Right. So. That's your first mistake. Anyway, where were we? Uh, the torture, the, the jellyfish torture. Yes, when? What? They, they zap him. Who? Oscar, as he's leaving Sykes' office. Okay, sorry, yeah. I thought you meant the full torture. No, no, that Not comes later. Oh, it's, just, it's just a little touch of torture. Yeah. I have, oh, wait. I have something to say about this, but yes. <laughs> um, Oscar tells Angie about the five yeah. grand that he owes. She says, Oscar, why did you get yourself into these situations? Learned helplessness. <laughs> Weaponized man... incompetence. Yeah, exactly. Um, he's like, I want to live at the top of the reef in the big city. He's like, I'm a nobody. Yeah. Yeah. Get over it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he's like my dad was the best tongue scrubber around <laughs> I bet he was <laughs> <laughs> tough tongue scrubbers daddy <laughs> I feel like tongue scrubber is 
code for something. Yeah. Um, Angie has a pink pearl from her grandmother. Yes. Which is worth exactly five grand. And she's like, take this. Yeah. Pay off Sykes. My, like, he's like, I'm going to die. My problem with this is his motivations are so childish. He's like, I, I just don't want to be. It's not like, oh, people made fun of me for wanting to be a tongue scrubber. And my dad worked so hard all this time. And he, he like provided for us. But people mocked him. And like, it's not like that complex. It's just like, no, I don't like being a tongue scrubber. But the stakes are like. Life Murder, <laughs> revenge killing by the mob, torture <laughs> by electrocution. And he's like, Mwah. like, it's so weird. This is a children's thing. It and he's is. like, I'm going to be murdered. You have just reminded me that on the Wikipedia article for this, it says like, many um, campaigners believe that it showed a negative portrayal of Italian Americans. <laughs> well, isn't like Robert De Niro banned from Italy or something? I don't know, probably. There's like a, an actor... Wait, Robert De Niro was in The Godfather, right? I'm not getting I that wrong. I think right. so. Yeah. Basically, the, one of the main actors in The Godfather was, or tried to get Italian citizenship. Al Pacino? Oh, maybe. But yeah. And all of Italy went, no! No, you can't! <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> so yeah. Because uh, this this film, it's not, it's, a, it's not a parody of Italian Americans. Yeah. The Italian ex community. Um, <laughs> <laughs> the Lady Gaga adjacent community. Yes. <laughs> Mamma mia. Yes. Um, it's like The Godfather and The Sopranos. Like they have yeah. loads of cast members do, yeah. from those gangster movies. Yeah, Shark Tale isn't like. What's it called? Patient X of the problem. Is that the phrase? Patient X? Patient Zero. Patient Zero, that's it. Like it didn't start. The, it's playing on a trope. Yes, she's Italian. Who? Madonna. Is she? It's, sorry, it's Madonna Ciccone. Oh, I didn't know that was her surname. Yeah, it is. I only know Lady Gaga. <laughs> German otter. German otter. She's not German, no. No. She's an otter. <laughs> a German otter. I'd love a German Stephanie otter. Stephanie the German otter. <laughs> Two of my favourite things. I l- Germans and otters. Yeah. And Lady Gaga. Three of my favourite things. The Holy Trinity. That's my the birthday. new Sound of Music song. <laughs> <laughs> Get me a German otter for my birthday. <laughs> Lady Gaga and German otters. <laughs> <laughs> These are two of my favourite <laughs> things. <laughs> Um, yeah, she, sorry, you were saying about the, she's pawned her grandmother's pearl. Oh no, she's giving him the pearl. Yeah. She's giving her a pearl necklace, <laughs> darling. Rene, have some self-respect. Literally, stop being such a simp for this little fish. Yeah. His, and Although, he's a, to be fair, we've seen how Will Smith defends his wife. That is I true. I would like to be stood up for in that manner. Yeah. I'd he's, like to slap Chris, Chris Rock. Yeah, fair enough. May I say something about the kind of fish that Oscar is? Yes. He's a Blue Street cleaner wrath, which is... Clean your ass. Clean a wrath, yes. <laughs> um, which is the, a kind of fish, like a pilot fish, that does actually, in reality, clean... Oh. Things, like, you know, teeth and gills and all that shit. They did a crumb of research they for this film. They did a crumb, as did I, yes. <laughs> <laughs> they did about the same amount of research as you did. Yes, exactly. Um, you could make a film. Yeah, I could. Um, so, but Angie's an angel fish. And I don't want to, like... Sure, date the cleaner ras fish, but like, and you could do so much better than this fish. Aim higher. Aim higher, babe. Fuck the puffer fish. Or He's the boss. The lion fish. <laughs> I would like to see it. <laughs> <laughs> How do fish have sex? <gasps> I've got more facts about bees. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> Come on, give it to me. So I was right about bees uh-huh. mainly being women, yeah. and that um, the bees fuck the the queen, and it snaps off, uh-huh. and they fall to their death. Yes. Um, they do it in a very specific, like, meter radius. Of what? It's like a designated fucking zone. What, like Stonehenge for bees? But no, it's, yeah, like, there's like... They had orgies at Stonehenge, like right? Or am I going crazy? Probably. There's <laughs> one, like, space near their hive. Uh-huh. The only place that they'll fuck. Oh, why? I don't know. Oh, you didn't do that much research. But they'll just, <laughs> that's, just where the, that's just where the fucking happens. Wow. Amazing. And if they miss the fucking time, <laughs> it takes like two seconds as well for them to fuck. Wait, so while they're flying through the air, they have to do it in the right meter zone? Yeah, it's a bit bigger than a meter, but yeah. Okay. Wow. Wild. What happens if they don't do it in the right zone? I think she, 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 they just like sense that they get into the edge of the zone and they're like, no, we'll turn oh, around. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> oh, no, not my zone. Um, yeah. Wow, that's amazing. I love bees. Uh, tell me how a fish fucks, please. Oh, I don't know that. All right, sea creature renaissance. 
Well, I'm not. That'd be the first thing I would be looking at <laughs> in my Renaissance. How do, right, I'll look it up right now. I've seen a fish poo. I mean, I think they just release sperm in the general area oh, of the got, egg. They d- uh, the eggs, they, do they lay the eggs and then they come on the eggs? Yeah, come on, think. the eggs. <laughs> How do fish have sex? Because in Finding Nemo, they didn't show it, but they showed the eggs. Yeah, they um they release eggs and sperm directly into a water column. So I wasn't wrong. It's just in the general area. Did he release his eggs into your water, water column? Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. God, I'd love someone to release their eggs into my water column. Anyway, we're at the shark <sighs> restaurant. Listen shark up if you're a fan of TikTok. Okay. Um, Don Lino is struggling with Lenny being a vegetarian. Yes. And he's like, eat this little shrimp. <laughs> and the shrimp <laughs> pleads for its life. Should we do it? Yes. <laughs> my sister had a baby and I took, took it over it because she passed away. And then the baby, baby lost its legs and its arms and now it's just a stump and I take care of it with my wife and, and it's growing <laughs> and it's fairly happy. You miss his working shifts at the factory. And it's difficult because I'm working a second <laughs> shift at the, the factory, factory to get, get food on the, the table. table. But all the love that I see in that little guy's face, it makes it worth it in the end. True story. <laughs> <laughs> My sister had a baby. <laughs> it's so funny. It's so good. Oh. I love it. So who voices the shrimp? I don't know, but an icon of our yeah. times. Yeah. Um, we'll find out it's like the person who voiced Zazu. I don't know. No, Rowan that's Atkinson. Rowan Atkinson. It's not him. It's not Rowan Atkinson. You know, but it'll be one of Someone the Someone who voiced the chicken in Moana. Exactly, exactly. Um, I think I know who that is, but I'm not going to say it. <laughs> oh. No, I just don't want to out myself as a, a nerd. Oh, sweet. I don't want people <laughs> to think of me as a Disney adult. I've don't got bad news. Dare. I, I just, think you act like you've been to Disneyland. I absolutely act like I've been to Disneyland. Have we explained that? We must have yes, done. Yes, we have. Um, if not, work it out. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, but I don't think... I, I wouldn't class myself as a Disney adult. No, for sure not. I'm just an adult who has enjoyed Disney things. Yes. Yes. So. So, take that. <laughs> I would take that adult. That's worse. What a shame we never listened. Mm. That was instrumental in my queerness. Was it? Brokeback Mountain video of Shame oh. by Gary Barlow. Well, and this Robbie is the Williams. thing, which is the one, there's one of them that's turned out to be a massive. Howard Donald. Yeah, arsehole. And I saw someone being like, you do know that like your entire branding was to appeal to gays. Yeah. He's such an arsehole. You did a song with Lulu. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yep. You can't be you can't be homophobic and do a song with Lulu. I'm sorry. Yeah, probably not. Probably not right. Not. It's not right. Um, um, he orders Lenny to eat the shrimp. Yes. But, but Lenny... He just frees it out the window and the whole shrimp cocktail. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds like if you go to like a gay bar, it'd be like, oh, it's a shrimp cocktail in here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a right shrimp cocktail. <laughs> Is that like if there's one woman in the gay bar? What do you mean? I just feel like that's what people would say. Oh, it's a shrimp cocktail. Oh, Oh, the woman would say it's a shrimp cocktail. No, the woman is the shrimp. No. Because gay men are homophobic. No. No. Gay men are misogynists. Shrimps are like, yeah. Shrimps are like little dicks. Uh, It's a shrimp cocktail. Just people got their dicks hanging out. The little dicks hanging out. lots of men. I don't know. I think you need to workshop this one. I think you need to workshop this. (laughs) (laughs) It's my birthday. (laughs) (laughs) Um, Don Lino gets Frankie to agree to show Lenny how to be a real shark. Yeah. Brackets, cis man. We'll come back to <laughs> we it. We will come back to it, yes. Um, um, Oscar has the money. <sighs> he's pawned his, he's prawned. I remember this scene giving me actual, like, palpitations as a child. I was This fuming. fucking idiot man. I was Fish. like, cool, the film's <laughs> over. Great, lovely time. Yeah. Hope he oh, dies. No. <laughs> Little eavesdropping Helen over here. <laughs> oh, I mean, because I, I hope he dies because he gets it all wrong. Spoiler alert. So he hears that he goes to the horse races where Sykes going to be. Mm-hmm. And he hears that one of the races is rigged. Yeah. Um, and he puts all his money on lucky day. Yeah. 200 to one. Puts all that five grand on. All that of five it. grand that would get him out of debt yeah. and not being killed. Yeah. He bets Angie's dead mother's. No, dead grandmother's pearl money yeah. on this horse. Who's who's given him her one nice thing. Yeah. T- out of the goodness... Well, because she fancies him. Yeah. To be fair, <laughs> who amongst us hasn't given away our dead grandmother's pearls to a man that we fancy? 
certainly me, but you know. Oh yes, and also me too. <laughs> oh, I've not done that. Uh, as he's putting his bet on, he's like, Who "I'm sh- Oscar the millionaire." Who turns around? The reason for the season. <laughs> Something for the dads and Caitlin. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lionfish called Lola, voiced by Angelina Jolie. Fuck it out. This film asks the immortal question: Can we make a fish fuckable? <laughs> but it doesn't ask: Should we make a fish fuckable? <laughs> I, this fish. <laughs> I'd fuck this fish. Yeah. Oh, we'd all fuck the fish. <laughs> They looked at those little cock virgins of Hell the <laughs> Fish. I believe you claimed you'd fuck half fish, half man Alan Rickman fish. Yeah, just sad. Huh? Oh, he was muscular. Yeah, he was muscular. He was a bit Quasimodo, but it's because he was coming through a pipe, I believe. <laughs> was he? <laughs> Great time for you. Something, something pipe. <laughs> Water column. Uh, <laughs> um, um, yeah, so she is a curvaceous... Big lipped fish with red hair. Well, fins in the shape of hair. It's like a poodle with tits. If you haven't listened to our Oliver and Company um, review, it's a poodle with tits. It's a poodle with tits. It's a fish with hair. It's <laughs> you know, it looks like Kylie Jenner. It's yes. It's 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 a, it's, a, it's a fuckable fish. It's a fu- very fuckable fish. I did I did a TikTok about this fish. I said that before. It did all right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. Uh, it did. It did. Yeah. Um, her name is Lola. Um, she is a fish. She's, a, a, as Wikipedia describes her, a gold digging fish. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, Wikipedia goes in on this fish, but she is very clear from the beginning. She says, deep down, I'm really superficial. Great line. Who amongst us? Yeah, she's she's very honest with what she wants. Yeah. But she learns that Oscar isn't a millionaire. Yeah. And she, she swims away. Yeah, fair enough. And then we watch the race. Genuinely, edge of my seat. Yeah, I was so upset. You, you'd seen this before, right? I went to see this in the cinema. Okay, yeah, good. I was going to say. This was quite a bit of my personality for a good couple of weeks. Oh. Yeah. Which bit? You might not <laughs> ever get rich. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. Um, but then The Incredibles came along. Have I told you my story about The Incredibles? No. But I went to see it and the film, the, the cinema had a power cut. No. So for a, until the DVD came out, like you have six told months me this later, year. I had no idea what happens after yeah. he takes Jack Jack and flies out through the ceiling. I thought that was the end of the film. Have you seen the dump truck ass yet? Of Mrs. Incredible? Yeah. Of course I had. <laughs> I was more into Mr. Incredible. I see that. I see that I for you. gay. Yeah. Oh anyway. God. We should the do race. the Incredibles. Why haven't we done the Incredibles? Edna Mode. Edna Mode. Have you seen the person Frozen. on TikTok who can walk like Edna? Yes. Very good. We're going to talk about TikTok. We're so young. Yeah. So hip fresh and fresh. Because we're 17. Yeah. Um, the Oscar Seahorse, because it's a seahorse race. Yes. Ha 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 ha. Ah, queer icon seahorses. Yes. Mm. Yeah. Um, the hit Oscar's Lucky Day. Can't get through the door. Can't even get out the door, which I think... Start the race Start again. Start the race again. Yeah, agreed. Open the door properly. Yeah. But we're not running it. No. So. <laughs> no. We wouldn't be either. No. Um, the, the, but the seahorse, like, comes against adversity, manages to get to first place, and just as he's about to get to the line, he trips. And whacks himself in the face with his own tail. Ugh. <laughs> Men! <laughs> Actually, we don't know the gender of the seahorse. Men, women. Yes. Both. Intersex seahorses. They're intersex, yeah. Yeah. But they spot, they're choppy changey. Yeah. Gender queer. Get pregnant. <laughs> that wasn't an order. <laughs> <laughs> it sounded like it. <laughs> no. Anyway, um, so they're like, fuck you, Oscar. We're going to tie you up at the bottom of the ocean. Going to lock you up in a whale. Did you say that? <laughs> it locks the, oh, yeah, like it's the trunk of a car. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, then they tied him up and torture him. Yeah. And zap him with their little... Yes. We get some dialogue between Frankie and Lenny, which I think they wrote, like, at, like, two minutes to five. (laughs) It's like, bada bing, bada boom, forget about it, capiche, you're gonna die, hey, capiche, kaboom, boom, 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 yeah, hey, forget about it. Yeah, it's about 12 times in one sentence. They're like, bada bing, bada boom. Um, Um, They see the tied up Oscar. Yes. And um, Frankie's like, go and eat him, Lenny. Go on. Yeah. Um... And he's like, I just can't. I'm a vegetarian. Mm-hmm. Um, 
and he like, does a whole like digging with the in the sand to make it look like he's eating him yeah and so all the him. dust comes up and frankie can't see anything he's like run run but then frankie's like fucking hell you tricked me and he chases him yeah and he gets hit in the head by an anchor and just straight up killed yeah it's like Your i remember passer. crying at this <laughs> wow as a child <laughs> you didn't deserve to die no yeah no, it's just circle of life wasn't there's it? a great line where he's like i'm so cold and then he's like that's because we're cold-blooded <laughs> <laughs> it's great it's funny yeah um it's bits um, so lenny runs off and the jellyfish appear again because yeah. they've heard a big boom and they think that oscar killed the shark and oscar goes along with it yes he's like, i am a shark slayer mm-hmm. yeah slay queen <laughs> Yes, work. work. Yes, hunty, yes. work, mom. Have you seen the Willy Wonka trailer? Uh, I've seen TikToks about it. <laughs> I'm just a little guy. <laughs> We're making chocolate, mom. <laughs> he sounds like Alyssa Redwoods. <laughs> he does, yes. Yeah. I, yeah, I have seen that. Um, and he also says, scratch that, reverse it. I know. Which isn't the isn't line. A, isn't a phrase. It's strike that, reverse yeah. it. Yeah. Which I, that people have said that they just dubbed it in because they don't want the word strike. In a trailer. Isn't his mouth saying scratch? His hands go over his mouth, so it could be. Oh. Yeah. Conspiracy. Anyway. Anyway. The crowd's going wild for Oscar. Katie Curran, Fiona off GMTV. Yes. Loving it. Um, Angelina Jolie sees him on TV and is Mm -hmm. like, fit. Back to gold digging, please. Yes. Um, Sykes makes himself Oscar's manager for a 50-50 deal. Yeah. Terrible. Awful deal. Don't take advantage of this Will Smith fish. Or do. I'm not fast. Oh, don't give a shit, actually. Uh, (laughs) (laughs) We we go to Frankie's funeral. And (laughs) the actor who played Columbo in Columbo. (laughs) Is playing Don Feinberg the leopard shark. (laughs) You are the wind beneath my wings. (laughs) <laughs> they just like, oh. push him off a boat a sunken ship yeah it's lovely it's touching it is lenny um, is kind of sneaking yeah and he hears don lino comparing him with frankie and like, the so wrong sad. son died yeah exactly and it's very sad yeah. that's jack black i know and so ira feinberg the leopard shark columbo shark <laughs> columbo shark tells don lino about the shark slayer Mm. Mm. It was, yes and it was like does anyone want me to do another song about the one from Titanic <laughs> so good um, Oscar gets the key to the city yeah he's in he, all the magazines he's got his penthouse he does an ad campaign for Gup <laughs> yes it's very good yeah clever um, he has a big party yes top of the reef yes Angie brings him a lava lamp oh and he's like I'll put it next to my massive fucking lava lamp what dickhead put it on the other side of the room I bet this fish has a mattress on the floor yeah and one cushion horrible I don't mean cushion I mean pillow either way he owns one of them it's, 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 he's using it's a cushion flat. as a pillow yeah oh don't yes we all know them yeah we've all dated them and by Have we I? all I mean you Me. specifically <laughs> <laughs> It's a Caitlin call out part. Happy yes. birthday. <laughs> uh, uh, he's like, I couldn't have done this without you, Angie. And here's a pearl necklace. And it's he quite comes nice. Comes across her neck. No, um. <laughs> <laughs> he's taken her grandmother's pearl and he's put other pearls to make a necklace. It's I nice. thought it was a bit tacky. It was a bit tacky, but she's also a purple fish. So it goes with her because it's pink tinged. Um, but it's, it kind of like reduces the sentimental value of the, the one grandma pearl sure it's very it's like, like look, i can um, get loads of these now well you know that thing about when because footballers not to harken back to last week um there's a whole thing about footballers or like rappers who grow up quite poor and then become like insanely rich yeah often spend it all immediately on like ah. i don't know cars and shit he's done the same thing he's bought an ugly necklace exactly yeah um and Ange, poor Ange, was expecting an engagement ring. Oh, she's she so... Yeah, there's a whole bit where he pulls out the um, the, the little box. It looks like a ring. Oh, my God. I didn't even clock that. Yeah, she's like, oh, my God, you shouldn't have. And she's, like, really, like, emotional. They've never dated. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> They're friends. <laughs> and Lola, this sexy lionfish. Fit. This fit fish. 
<laughs> appears. It's like, can I steal him? And she's like, mm. just, I hate people who don't just say that they like people. Yes, I'm looking at you. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> just if you like someone, just say it. And either they like you and you fuck them or they, they don't, don't like you and you, and you move on. never speak to them again. Yeah. You go and live in the woods. Ideally. <laughs> <laughs> Just, I just little cave like the unlovable hermit you are if you like <laughs> i do like okay we'll do it then i will <laughs> god if i had a nickel for every time that i had to, if i had a, a, a an urchin for every <laughs> time i had to go live in the woods <laughs> yeah. you wouldn't have <laughs> any I urchins told that I, no i wouldn't yeah kept it to myself bury yeah. that bury it compartmentalize can't spell compartmentalize without com <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say mental. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> I thought you were trying to say it was compartmentalised. Uh, uh, if the shoe fits. There we go. If the water column fits. <laughs> if the water column fits. And I'll make it fit. Yeah. Fit. Um, the uh, party is ruined because there's a shark. There's a shark on the edge of the reef. Yeah. And everyone looks to Oscar for a slaying. Slay queen. Yes. But he's doing nothing of the sort. He's cowering. Yeah. and But luckily the shark is Lenny. Yes. Um who's very scared mm-hmm. because he's heard that there's a shark slayer going around. Yeah. Um, Lenny, it's revealed to Lenny that Oscar is the shark slayer, which he finds very, very funny, and then puts two and two together and realises that Oscar is profiting from his brother's death. Yes. And then he moves on. Um, <laughs> and then he's like, can I come home with you? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> What is this? He has no emotions towards this. He's like, oh, fair enough. You do what you got to do. <laughs> it's so weird. Certainly laugh, babe. Yeah. Um, well, he does threaten to expose Oscar if he doesn't let him stay. That is true. He sees opportunity. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I'm going to profit of you profiting off mm. my dead brother. Yeah. Um, and Oscar finds out that Lenny's dad is the big boss of all the Don sharks. Don Yeah. The next day, there's a call between the two of them. Yes. Don Lino threatens Oscar. And yeah. he's like, my guys are coming for you. Gonna tell you fin from fin. Yeah. Very good. And Lola's all sexy and is like, you gotta show him who's She's boss. breaking and entering. <laughs> <laughs> like, he's in his home. He turns around and she's there. She claps to change the lights. Has a fish clapping. <laughs> that ass. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, both. Both are physically impossible. Yeah, it'd be quite a slow clap in the water. They didn't yeah. have great... I forgot it was underwater for a lot of this. Yeah, because of the paint. <laughs> <laughs> Not consistent with how paint reacts the underwater. The electric lights. Yeah. <laughs> um, he tells Lola he wants to retire to avoid being beaten up by a shark. Eaten by a shark. And um, Lola tells him not to retire because he doesn't want to go back to the bottom of the reef. Um, she, he has to show the sharks who's boss and they'll leave him alone. To be fair, he's made a lot of money off killing one shark. Yeah. Just kill one more. Exactly. And then, well, that's then very much the plan. Retire. Yeah. 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 Um, Oscar goes to talk to Lenny, but Angie's there and she's found out everything. Yes. I enjoy... So I don't like Angie at the very beginning of the film, but I enjoy this because he says, sharks are coming to get me. And she says, and they should. <laughs> <laughs> Die, bitch. <laughs> like, she's great. Then perish. Yeah, I love her. Uh, they concoct a plan to make it look like Lenny's been killed so that Lenny can disappear and start a new life and um, so that Oscar can have more glory and more yes. money. Um, they stage a big fight yes. where he like twizzles mm-hmm. Lenny around his head. It's good. Like, slams him into mm-hmm. the Times Square lights which spark and fizzle. Yeah. Everyone should be dead. Yeah. Um, there's also a bit where Lenny, Lenny accidentally eats him Mm-hmm. and he like slowly opens his mouth so it looks like Oscar's forcing his mouth open it's and great. then he does loads of like lines from films he didn't really make like, sense. are you not entertained yeah you, you have me, me at hello, hello. <laughs> <laughs> um, you can't handle the truth yeah exactly yeah. Um, Lola kisses him on camera very forcibly you'd let her yeah it's there, Ange- there sexy Angelina big, Jolie um, fish there's a there's a lot of dialogue rhetoric online about how lola is abusive and i'm like yeah is there <laughs> yeah, but yeah like they're like she forces herself on him and later she beats him up and i'm like number one they're animated fish but two yeah no one thinks this fish is a nice person apart from me i'd let her do what she wants <laughs> also, 
who it, cares enough about this film? People have a lot of opinions about this film. Fucking fish. hell. I know. It's not a B-movie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but, uh, yeah. Get a job. <laughs> I know. Jesus. But I thought we should point it out unless so someone Who's doesn't Who's writing say, opinion pieces? I don't know. About Shark Tale. But it's there. To be fair, we're doing at least an hour of <laughs> <laughs> opinions on Shark Tale. It's true. Um, so, yeah. But half of that was talking about sexy bees. Yes. Bee mo- we should do bee movie. I said that last week. I can't remember what happened last week. <laughs> That's fair enough. Um, yeah, so she kisses him very forcibly. But and Angie's livid because she sees it on the telly. Yes, exactly. Um, she confronts Oscar about mm-hmm. Lola. Yes. And he's like, well, like, what am I going to do if I'm a nothing? No one loved me when I was a nothing. And she's like, I loved you when you were nothing. Brave, Brave. to admit that. Brazen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Lenny has disguised <laughs> himself. As <laughs> Sebastian, the whale-washing, whale-washing dolphin. dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. Oh, no. Oh, God, don't get PTSD from being thrown like a rugby ball. (laughs) (laughs) Have you heard that orcas can call your name? How's it going (laughs) to feel when you call my name? Fucking terrifying. So... What um, they be like? Kate! So, they... um, they do lots of screaming, obviously. So if, you, if you're underwater and there's orcas coming at you, they do big screams. Mm-hmm. But they've taught themselves to, like, say words. I have a TikTok of it. There are. I mean, it's, it's a big time for orcas. It's huge. Isn't it? They're, <laughs> they're killing. Mm. Have you seen the video of the person in the boat with the or- where the orcas tear out the bottom of the boat? No. It's fucking terrifying. I love orcas. I they're love the so orcas cool. in this because they keep fainting. It's yeah. really funny. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'll send you lots of TikToks about orcas. Well, dolphins aren't nice people either. They're not. It's Fatphobic. Especially... <laughs> homophobic. Yeah. They live in Florida. Some are gay. Some are gay, um, but a lot of them are rapists. Yeah. Uh, I mean, yes. Actual rapists. Actual rapists, yeah. And they're really mean to tuna. Mm, okay. Dolphin-friendly <laughs> tuna. What? So, you know dolphin fr- Oh, got you. Okay. I tried it. It didn't work. No, I do see what you did. Thank you. <laughs> it's actually the tuna that would be mean to the dolphin. Yeah, that's why. Th- yeah, that's why I didn't. Yeah. Didn't f- cut it, Miriam. Can you cut this bit out, please? Miriam. <laughs> Miriam, don't make me look like a fool again. Because <laughs> <laughs> every other time it's been Miriam's fault. <laughs> <laughs> Miriam's just sitting in the back with one of those um, like beads on wire things that you get at the dentists. <laughs> having a nice time you mean in the reception area yeah. that kids play with okay right got you <laughs> okay oh, right. anyway um, um oscar a talks sad to montage oh yeah i didn't care but i fast forward uh, yes yeah, <laughs> oscar um, talks to lola who is called... sick of having to pick up this sad clown and dust him off and send him <laughs> on his way her face she's like you're the cleaner ass <laughs> yeah Exactly. Why have I got to clean everything up? Exactly. Like, he's like, oh, I'm sad. And she's like, okay, I don't know how to help you. You're really rich. (laughs) (laughs) And then she calls Angie a nobody. She's not wrong. (laughs) Um, But he's like, nah, nah, nah. I'm breaking up with you. Yeah. And she's like, absolutely (laughs) not. And she slams him into a window. (laughs) It's, it's, yeah. Yeah. Intense. It's intense. (laughs) Necessary, but yeah. intense. Oscar buys chocolates in a balloon. How's Odd. the balloon there? Yeah, don't. Uh, actually, it would float anyway. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, Why is a fish eating chocolates? How do fish know what chocolate is? You got me there. Where's a fish getting cocoa solids from? Okay, fine. This this film has two plot holes. <laughs> <laughs> but he goes to the car wash. Well, well, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And she's not there. He gets a call from Luca the Octopus. I love this bit. <laughs> Tell me what you this love bit it. was really funny. <laughs> oh, it was the like, bit with the... <laughs> it's like we want to yes. meet up. Uh, and if you don't come to the meet up, um, if you, <laughs> you better come if you don't want to see us sleeping with the fishes. The dead The fishes. dead ones. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's like, if you agree, nudge your head. Did you nudge your head? <laughs> yeah. Because they're on the phone and he can't see. Yeah, it's good. funny. So Oscar, Sebastian, mm-hmm. and Sykes yeah. go to the meeting. Yeah. But 
he is uh lenny is nervous because he's like i can't go in and say hey pop i'm a dolphin do you now want to talk about your theory about this film i will at the end oh okay fine but like put you know you know what i'm gonna say listeners yeah. put the pieces <laughs> together um don lino does a monologue yes i use this monologue in a lip sync <laughs> what at the hackney empire <laughs> Why? <laughs> so it was for Halloween. Yeah. It was a show for the glory. Uh-huh. And um, I did Jaws. Yeah. So I, I remember a that. shark yeah, okay. costume and yeah. some Heelys. <laughs> well, I had my Heelys already. Yeah. And I heeled around the stage like I was gliding. Lovely. It was really cool. And I did like the Jaws and I did Lady Gaga's teeth. Nice. And I did this monologue. Uh-huh. Uh, I did a bit about, uh, by Ricky Gervais. Uh, Boo. I, did, Wouldn't I do like do that his again. cat bit that's on TikTok. He does it well. It's one bit about cats that's quite funny and everything else is not very good. Not many people have done things about sharks. I was scraping the bottom okay, of the sure. barrel. I'm sure you could find Neddy is our bit. And Susie then I did, I did Shallow. Nice. Yeah. I really want to watch The Shallows. It looks like a stupid film. I've not seen it either. Oh, we should watch it. I love a shark film. Can we do Shark Girl Summer? Have you seen the Sharknado with Abby Lee Miller from the Abby Lee Miller Dance Company? And Alaska? No? Uh, they might be the same film, might be different films. Might okay. be many Sharknado films, but yes. a shark lands on her head <laughs> I have and seen just swallows that her whole. Yeah. Obsessed. Obsessed. <laughs> uh, they reveal the tied-up Angie underneath the cloche. And that Lola the lionfish has betrayed Oscar. Fuck. There's one thing I like better than money. Revenge. Fit. So fit. Four. Yeah. Um, yeah, Oscar pretends not to know her. Mm-hmm. Not to know Angie. Yes. And Lola's like, no, she's lying. Yeah. He's, he doesn't know her. Um, Sebastian, the dolphin, does a big surprise move and like gets Angie in his mouth. Yeah. And rescues her. Mm-hmm. Um, There's a great bit where Oscar, to be like, hey, fuck you, I can do what I like, sticks a spoon to a hammerhead shark's forehead. <laughs> and he's like, what did he do? I can't see. <laughs> so good. I can't see. Um, hammerhead sharks are stupid. A little bit, but... You know. What ha- what went wrong evolutionarily? I don't know. They see very wide. I just Probably don't... wider than we can, though. Because they got wider eyes. I thought you said they seem very wide. No, they see. <laughs> Maybe I did say that. I don't know. Wide, wide loads. Wide. Mm. Lovely. Um, Sebastian voms up. Everything, including and Angie. Was, and Don Lino's like, I would know that throw up anywhere. <laughs> my son. My, son, my boy. I know this isn't the point. <laughs> they massacred my boy. <laughs> yeah. I know this isn't the point, but um, most sharks are colorblind. So oh, I don't really? know. Yeah, I don't know how he would not be able to tell that's his son just because they painted him blue. A lighter shade of grey. Yeah. <laughs> He's got a pointy nose on as well. But also, you'd He's be like... He's a fucking shark binder. Yeah. <laughs> to, make his, to make his nose squish down. A shark binder. It's a shark. He's wearing a binder. Also, he's got his gills out and dolphins <clears throat> don't have gills. Yeah. Because they're mammals. Yes? I'm pretty... I'm, well, n- now you've put me on the spot. You've I got assume... up close personal with some dolphins. <laughs> don't! Stop it! <laughs> it's because they've got their holes. Yes, little blowholes. They don't need gills. Like whales. Who are also mammals. God, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> sea creature renaissance. Um, um, okay. Don, Don Lino is livid. And he says to Oscar, yeah. like, you killed my son. You dolphined my other son. What did I ever do to you? And I'm like, that's fair, honestly. It's, it's quite fair. <laughs> yeah. Like... He tries to eat Oscar. This was a big part of the game. <laughs> being chased by Don Lino. Oh, I see. This was five seconds of the film. Yeah. Because he went out a porthole. I think there's also a bit where you... I, in the game, I'm pretty sure Lenny smells blood and actually tries to chase you at one point. But I might uh, be getting it confused. That's like Finding Nemo. Oh, I'm thinking of that. Oh, um, I used Finding Nemo in my lip sync as well. I should, I should point out. Okay, maybe I'm getting confused with that. Fish are know. friends, not food. Yes. Um... <laughs> Uh, the shrimp attack. <laughs> yes, he gets stuck in the porthole. Yes. And the shrimp is like, remember me, cunt? <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> oh, my sister had a babe. <laughs> and sets all the shrimps on him. Mm-hmm. But he breaks free. Yes. Um, like Ariana Grande. Yeah. Oscar goes to the car wash. Oh, oh, oh wash. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. And traps Lenny instead of Don Lino by yes. accident. He, he tries to swerve through the, the machinery. Yeah, and clamp him up. Yeah. But he gets Lenny. Yeah. 
but then he also, also traps Dolido. So this whole thing, like they trap, the traps them facing each other. Yeah, but also, I swear, if sharks stop swimming, they die. Really? Pretty sure. Because they need um, oxygen to go. Th- if they keep moving, oxygen goes through their gills. I'm pretty sure. Crocodiles can't turn quickly. Oh. So if you're ever being chased by a crocodile, zigzag. Zigzag. Yeah. Wow. If you're ever being chased by a shark, bonk it on the nose. Just get out of the water. Yeah, it's true. If you're ever being bullied online, shut your laptop. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. And um, that's Kate's advice corner for the week. <laughs> Bye. The, the documentary channel. <laughs> no, I don't mean the documentary. What's the one that does like, I don't know, nature documentaries and shit? David Attenborough. Yeah. We should have him on. <laughs> <laughs> He's quit yeah. now. He's what? I don't know. He could be queer. I don't think he is. He should be. He's got like old homo energy. He does. You can't spell homo sapiens without penis. Really? (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) God. I'm so good at spelling. This is so good. This is gold. (laughs) This this is why we're in the Guardian's Top 50 Funny Podcast. (laughs) Yes. We are milking that. It was about three years ago. (laughs) And we've died out on that ever since. Yeah. As we should. Um, I think we offer a a, a strong content to a niche group of people. Exactly. Brackets derogatory. (laughs) Yeah, we're very specific, aren't we're we? We're in that niche group of people. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we are. Oh, f- fucking hell. We are, are brackets we? derogatory. Boy, howdy, are we? <laughs> um, <laughs> um, yeah, he traps them both facing each other. Yes. Maybe killing them, maybe not. Mediates a kind of family reunion. And he comes clean to Kate oh, Carrick. Oh, yes, yeah. Um, about the anchor. Yeah. Um, yeah, Lenny's like, You'll, I'll never be the shark that you want me to be, Dad. Yeah. Being a shark is your dream, not mine. Mm-hmm. Um, and he says, so what? Your son likes kelp. <laughs> and he's, so he says, it. I love you, son, no matter what you eat or how you dress. He says, your son likes to dress like a dolphin. And like everyone else loves your son. Why yeah, can't you? Exactly. It's a queer narrative. It is a queer narrative. <laughs> it, it is. It just mm-hmm. is. Yeah, it just is. It can't be anything else. <laughs> yeah. What else is it supposed to be? Well, like you can't accept your son because he's a vegetarian. To be Not fair. that fucking surface level <laughs> textual analysis. And also, vegetarian and gay, we go together uh, like, like a rabbit like lama lama. Vegetarians and gays. <laughs> <laughs> Could dig a ding ding dong. Yeah. Uh, Oscar makes up with Angie. Yes. Um, and with Don Lino. Don Lino says he's sorry. He says, um, hey, Don Lino, are we cool? And he's like, yeah, we're cool. The, the re- How does that manifest? The reef is safe. We won't eat any of you fish. What are you eating then? You're going to die, hen. Yeah. You stopped swimming and now you're not eating. <laughs> R.I.P. to the girl you used to yeah. see. <laughs> uh, we get an epilogue. Yes. Oscar has become manager of the car wash, a position he is not necessarily qualified for. His dad was a top tongue scrubber. So he's a Nepo baby is what you said. Oh my God. <laughs> Nepo baby. Someone called Ben Smithish. Platt. <laughs> No comment. No comment. Shut it down. <laughs> I don't think we're going to talk about that bit now. No. Um, he's co-owning it with Sykes, who is yeah. dressed like a full pimp. Yeah. This might be the last cultural reference I remember of pimps. There was a point in the early two thousand two monsters unleashed. When was that released? Similar time. Okay. Yeah. There was a big big moment. time for pimps. Huge. <laughs> <laughs> big pimp. Huge. Yeah. <laughs> well, he is because he's a puffer fish. So he gets he bigger. Be, even bigger pimp. Yeah. <laughs> is there a We're going to need a bigger pimp. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's yours, isn't it? That's yours. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Layers. Look at that. God. Very specific niche. Yeah. <laughs> but it's good, it's good. It's, good. it's worth the it's, wait. It's yeah. worth the hour and 15 wait, honestly. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> um, and then they open up a car door. 
<laughs> and who's here? Who the fuck's here? It's Missy Elliott fish. It's Fishy Elliott. And Christina. Fish Christina Aguilera. <laughs> it's a jellyfish, but yeah. She's a, you can't spell jellyfish without fish. It's true. <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> this is what they stay for. <laughs> the spelling. Yeah. Um, they have somehow paid Missy Elliott enough to say a shark tail exclusive <laughs> into our microphone. <laughs> Those are the two similarities between me and Missy Elliott. We both shared, <laughs> said a Shark Tale exclusive into a microphone. I'm not going to say it, just so it's your special thing oh, with Missy you. Elliott. Oh, she's also probably gay. Yeah. Yeah. They didn't do a very well. <laughs> they d- just say Missy Elliott Fish isn't fuckable. Just say it. <laughs> just say it. Missy Elliott Fish isn't fuckable. <laughs> Thank you. Fishina Aguilera, on the other hand. Oh my God. It. I will actually say, I'm going to take that back. Missy Elliott Fish is giving early 2000s lesbian chic. She has got a fringe. Yeah, that's what a, I mean. A yes. swept over fringe. Yeah. <laughs> that's, she yeah. looks like Missy Elliott. I said what I said. <laughs> <laughs> they do look like them as well. They do. This is what I mean. Wild. Sykes, no. Martin Scorsese profile on a puffer fish. They've done well. Actually, They've done well. Pop your feet up and get the dildo out, Hen. You've Sorry? done well. <laughs> Have you not seen that Nicola Sturgeon thing? No. <laughs> Someone tweeted like, pop your feet up and get the dildo out, Nicola. You've had a good day. <laughs> and then when wow. she got arrested, someone like photoshopped it to be like, <laughs> put your feet down <laughs> and get put the dildo away. Oh my God, I haven't seen that. It's, I'll, I'll send wow. it to you. Okay. Um, we get some dancing turtles. Yes, lovely. lovely. And all the sharks come for a wash yes. and for custom paint jobs. Yes, they get like flames on the side of them. And one of them looks like a clown. Yeah, he seems very sad. <laughs> sad clown. <laughs> the sad, sad tears of a clown. Yeah. We get Martin Scorsese saying, yo. While dressed as a pimp. Yeah. Um, I think they were trying to recreate the magic of the end of, is it Shrek 2, where they have the lots of singing and dancing? The Shrek and the Sump Karaoke Dance Party. That's, That's it, Shrek 1. Yeah. I'm going to take things low. Yeah. Don't go changing. Mm. I could do the full Shrek of the Swamp Karaoke dance party. <laughs> Please don't. I won't. Don't worry. <laughs> it's my um, special day. <laughs> that's your present. Music by Hans Zimmer. <laughs> <laughs> this is. Sorry. The credits are upsetting <laughs> where they just have freeze frames of them. Yeah. In their, I mean, this, it's animated. You can choose where the freeze frame. You can, yeah. You can, every frame, you can make them look mm. nice. And yet, you, you put, the when Will Smith has his a gawpy fish mouth open yeah and the credits Mm-mm. i'd be slapping yeah that's the so, end as we've discussed queer Qu- queer probably one of the most like overtly queer things yeah that we've watched yeah big Absolutely. time for 2004 exactly you wouldn't get that nowadays mm-hmm. um a, a smorgasbord of fuckable fish <laughs> a sushi platter yes of fuckable fish exactly um a I stargazy def- pie <laughs> of fuckable fish oh my god that's horrible that's, that's evil. awful yeah that's not right it's not right um yeah as i have expressed angelina jolie fish was a very important fish in my life uh, yeah yeah and i yeah i was like i want to look like her yeah i've not achieved that but you know you could be a Rene. Uh, <laughs> that is the nastiest thing that anyone's ever said. <laughs> what? Uh, d- double Academy Award winner Rene Zellweger? Yeah. yeah. Fuck yeah, exactly. to be. Yeah. 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 The B movie's not realistic. There's so many men in that. Oh. He's got a dad. You does, shouldn't have a dad. He should be dead. Does the B try and fuck a person in that? They go on dates. That's weird. Yeah. And then <laughs> the, the one man who is like, this is weird, is presented as the villain. Oh. Hmm. You like jazz? <laughs> we'll do that at some point. Yeah, well, at some point. Not doing it for my point. birthday. Um, we decided what we're doing. Caitlin's yeah. ratings. Oh! <laughs> oh. On a scale of 9 to 48. 49. Wow. Yeah, it goes off the scale. I had to do some maths in my head then. <laughs> What's 1 plus 48? <laughs> I had to like, try, I don't know. Wow. <laughs> it's your special day. <laughs> it's my special day. <laughs> tired all right it's been a long recording it's actually been one of our shorter ones <laughs> um yeah yeah queer queer camp, camp. 
Fabulous. Fabulous. Nice. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. I had a great time watching this. <laughs> Me too, actually. I was right it wouldn't hold up. But and it was an hour and a half. Exactly. Yeah. And most of that was credits. Yeah. Lovely time. Wonderful time. So, <laughs> if you enjoyed this, if you're in that very specific niche group of people, which yeah. is growing. It is. Um, tell a friend. Tell a friend who might be part of the niche group of people. Yeah. Tell, tell an, an enemy. enemy. Who might be part of the niche group of people. Yeah. Tell. Tell Angelina Jolie. Yeah, go on. Academy Award winner Angelina Jolie. <laughs> that her best work is a lionfish called Lola. I can't think of anything better that she's done. No. No. Oh, divorcing Brad Pitt. Uh, estranging herself from her father. Oh, I don't know about that. John Voight, bad man. Being a bicon. Sorry, we haven't even talked. So talk- sorry. Oh my God. She- Look up her and her girlfriend from, I'm going to say, the late 90s. I will. Oh my God, they're so fit together. Anyway. Lovely time. Yeah. Tell them. Leave a rating or a review. Please do. We haven't had them in a little while because and- we stopped asking. <laughs> <laughs> but we're asking again now. Yes, it's Kevin's birthday. It's, a it's birthday my present. birthday. Yes. Um, unless it's not a nice review, in which case, keep it to your fucking yeah. self. Yeah. Goodness me. Can't think why. Mm-hmm. You'd have one of them. Um, you can follow us at Queers Gone By. Yeah. Where can we follow you, Caitlin? You can follow me at a Caitlin Powell on Twitter and Instagram. And we can look at your short tail TikTok. Oh, sure. I'll share it. It's all right. What, what's your TikTok? <clears throat> Caitlin R. Powell. Just search Caitlin Powell and I'll probably Just be there. Search. It's Just not Caitlin R. Powell. Whisper it into a conch shell. Yeah. <laughs> Put it in a pigeon. Not in a pigeon. Put it in a pigeon. <laughs> Find the pigeon's water column, <laughs> put it in there. Oh my god! And you can follow me at the Kate Butch. Yes. I keep forgetting that it's different. Yeah. Changed it mm. on everything. Mm. I've not done the Shark Tale TikTok. I did do a Buffy TikTok that didn't do oh, super well. Did not. But I think we could we could boost it. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see you next week. <laughs> Until then, that's what we keep doing. <laughs> keep shoving it in your water column. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Shove it up your water column. <laughs> Keep shoving it up your water column or in your water column? I think up your water okay. column. Upwards motions. Yeah. We'll see you next week for my birthday. Yes! Can't remember what I said we were going to do, uh, but we'll find we'll out. We'll find out. And, and until, until then, then <laughs> keep shoving it up your water, water column. column. <laughs> Good God. The big one seven. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>